Hello peeps, long last again, <laughs> Jojo here. I think my last video was about my Laura Geller makeup unboxing. I need to do a go back on that and give you my review now that I've used it for a while. I don't have on any today, so excuse me, but you know. I got to go thrifting on Saturday, first time in a long time, and I actually got to walk around, not in a wheelchair, I was able to walk use my walker and be able to sit. So I was excited and uh, I bought some silly things that I really probably didn't need, but I just loved them anyway. The first thing my husband found, but it's a little, I think it's by Libby. And let me look on the bottom. Huh? Well, I don't know what it says, but anyway, it's to hold Splenda packets, sugar packets and I like to have little tea parties on occasion, and I thought that would be a welcome addition to our table. The second thing I bought was only $2, and I thought it was just precious. Look at this little creamer and sugar. I like the top on the creamer, I mean on the sugar bowl. It's got the cut glass, cut crystal. I think it's crystal, I really do, because, uh, the bottom is pretty sharp. You know, it's, I think it's cut. And look at all the little hob star. I just think it's beautiful. And then I like how squatty the little creamer is. I thought it was so cute. But anyway, $2 for the set. I thought, I can't leave that there. It would be rude. So we got the creamer sugar. Well, the first thing I had seen actually in the place was a basket. And y'all, you know I'm obsessed with baskets. I'm a longer burger girl. Plus, I also like the Nantucket baskets. I like, it's just the whole, oh, sorry. Oh, lousy. It's the whole Nantucket thing with me. I mean, uh, the basket weave to me. When I was a little girl, we made placemats for our Thanksgiving meal or something. And I remember we cut slits and did it. And I just loved it. And I guess that has gone into my adult life. My, much to my daughter's agony. She doesn't think I need baskets, but I need them in my life. But look, look, how precious is that? I used Google and I found one and this one was in such perfect condition. And I think we paid $4 for this. So I think we did pretty good. If you have any idea about what this is or where it is, whatever, let me know. Anyway, you can tell I went all on the pretties today. <laughs> Look what I got. Look how cute this little picture is. It's cut as well. I just think it's gorgeous. So if anybody knows who made, I couldn't find this on Google. Isn't it beautiful? I thought when we have the grands here and we have a breakfast, why don't we elevate our everyday and put syrup in this? Good idea, huh? I thought it so. I just thought it would be something pretty to use. And I want to use it. We've got to start using our things, you know? If we don't, all it's going to do is end up in a yard sale when we're gone. That's what I figure. Oh, the last thing I bought is heavy. Oh, look. I just thought it was beautiful and it's so sparkly and just, I don't know who made this, but I like it. I like around the top, that little swag and bow look. Swag, jabo and swag. See there, it's what it looks like. I thought it was just beautiful. I could not find this on Google. But anyway, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six pieces of crystal or glassware, and we paid $14 for everything. Uh, there was a 20% off at that uh, thrift store that day, so we made out like bandits, I thought. Uh, we go to this one thrift store, it's called Ground 40, and it's through our church. Our church uh, started this program. It's for uh, men 
battling addiction and they have a farm and the men go to live there and it's had great success. They've had, you know, of course, with anything, there's some that fall back, but it's really a great ministry and we support it monetarily and also through going to the thrift store. And uh, anyway, we had lost a nephew to addiction and overdose. And so it's really close to our heart to do for that ministry. Well, anyway, thank you for watching. And uh, hopefully this will be the start of me coming back to YouTube. And if you would like, please give it a thumbs up. And I'll talk to you folks later. Bye-bye.